What is going on, guys? Back here with a brand new Roblox jailbreak video. So today, guys, I'm going to show you guys literally everything that you need to know of how to play Roblox jailbreak. I'm going to show you guys how to rob robberies, how to get cars, how to get weapons, and obviously master this game. So this video is mostly for beginner. So if you guys just started playing this game, this video is probably going to go ahead and be for you and help you master at the game. Before we start, guys, there is going to be a Robux code hitting in this video. So make sure you guys be the first one to go ahead and look for it. And by the way, I'm making it super hard this time all right so once you guys low inside the game you guys got two options all right there's police and a prisoner options over here and click prisoner and click play so there's a lot of escape ways in the game but the most common escape way right here is gonna be the punching box so once you guys go over here you want to make your way over to this little punching box go over here and click f on your keyboard and just like that you guys can see here all right you know that little bar is chopping and once you guys get it down to all the way over here it's the door should be open and you guys can go ahead and get over the gate jump on this little box right here escape this over here all right so once you guys escape go over here making your way over on this gate right here and you should be escaped out of the prison all right that's literally you know how you escape right here so the objective of this game is literally basically cops versus criminal so once you guys escape out of the prison you guys can go ahead and make your way over here there is going to be a car waiting for you right here it's just going to go and click e to enter the driver and then you want to go over here onto this side all right there's gun store right here. You guys can go ahead and pick your guns. Based on personal reference, I guess I can't really tell you guys which gun is the best. But if you guys are very good at aiming, AK-47 is a pretty good spot. And obviously, get the shotgun too, you know, for close range. Alright, so once you guys escape and you literally got cars and the guns, want to go over here and click on this little small map. Alright, so go over here and click at waypoints and you guys can go to wherever robbery it is. So once you guys open the map, you guys should see there is going to be a red dot and there is going to be a green dot. Green basically means that robbery is open and red mean it's closed all right so soon you guys can see here this thing is green so i'm gonna go and click on that and it's gonna tell you where to go just gonna go and follow this little red right here all right so here's power plan all right this is how you rob it you want to go and touch this little thing right here and then you want to go and connect the numbers with other number then you want to go down here just like this connect the number with the number again you can escape this power plan so first store is done guys and you should see this little red line right here just follow the red line once you guys are out so the volcano base is very popular if you guys dropping anything you have to go to the volcano base here mostly all the time so let's gonna go over here and make your way into the volcano base there should be this little lady right here and just like that you just drop with your first store and now open the map again all right let's gonna go over here click on the map again and go to the museum dinosaur looking icon right over here so this is the only robberies that require two people inside of the game so yeah you may need a friend for this all right just like like this once you guys head up to the museum it's gonna say place the dynamite let's gonna go over here and click e and also your friends have to click e as well so you guys can go here and rob the museum so it's pretty easy all you need to do is go over here and click e to go ahead and grab all of the bone there's a little like a tons of stuff to rob painting right over here for example or this one right over here but the most important part guys is the puzzle so by using your mouse you guys can go over here and solve this little puzzle right over here just like that once you guys solve this this door is gonna be open you guys can go over here and pull out the lever and by the way you have to pull this exact same time with your friends so your friends have to go ahead and also solve this and go ahead and pull as well so once again go over here and add waypoint to the volcano and just like this here is your museum money here just like that boom perfect sauce all right so next up is gonna be the train here you guys should see the train every now and then you can hop on the train just like this you guys can go ahead and hold the cash get the money in the game then you can go over here back to the volcano base again to redeem your money just like this look at that i got some cash here all right next up guys you have to pickpocket a cops for this all right so go up to any cops go over here and pickpocket them just like this and you should get a key card it should be like the little blue items here all right so the next place to rob here is gonna be the bank all right let's go over here click the little cd button it's gonna take you to the bank let's go over here and rob bank all right so i'm gonna go over here and just go ahead and touch this door with the key card and you guys can rob the bank your bank floor may be different than mine because because obviously jailbreak has like 10 bank floor so it's different each time you guys play the game but you know the concept is basically literally the same there should be a vault right here with a bunch of gold and you guys can collect your money if you just thought that you guys actually want to go and buy some game pass i'm kind of suggesting this pro garage right over here as well as the duffel bag it's literally the only game pass that you need in this game all right and once you guys ready there should be a second door right over here on this side of the map you guys can go ahead and place out the dynamite wait for this dynamite to be open 
And make sure you guys watch out for the police because the police is literally everywhere. All right, so once you guys open this door, you can literally go ahead and climb up here and uh, basically escape the bank just like this. So next to the bank, there is another store right here that you guys can rob. This store is called the J Store. All right, so when you go over here and touch this little X button, there's another X right over here as well. Either way works, you want to go inside and you want to click that F button on your keyboard right over here to punch this J Store. All right, so we're going to go over here and make sure you dodge all the laser, right? There's like a literally like tons of laser here. Now, what you guys want to do is you want to go ahead and make up stair, right? So just go over here on this little stair right here. And then you want to go ahead and make it all the way up. Make sure you guys dodge all of this laser here. You can also click this little control button right over here to roll. So if you want to go over here and go a little bit faster, you guys can click that control button to go ahead and roll all the way up to the J store. All right, once you guys made it to the top, you guys can go ahead and escape the door and go ahead and jump out, get your car again. Here we go, just like that. You can also rob the airplanes inside of Roblox Jailbreak. All right, next robbery, guys, is going to be the tomb. So you want to go over here and add this little tomb icon here just like this it's gonna take you to the tomb so the tomb is gonna be a little bit different in here you guys can see there is three spots and it's gonna require three people inside of the server to activate this tomb but once you guys have three people right over here you guys can go ahead and open the tomb all right let's gonna go ahead and get inside the tomb here just like this so tomb is more advanced all right if you guys actually play jailbreak here it's kind of more difficult compared to another robberies but you know at the end of the day this robbery is probably gonna be the coolest but what do you guys want to do is you want to go over here and just dodge all of this when i walk over this bridge right here so the points of robbing tomb is gonna be grabbing a diamond you want to go and get inside and click e on one of those diamonds this door is gonna be open you want to go over here and click sit all right by clicking the e and there you go all you need to do right now is just legit click e on your keyboard to duck all of this if you forgot to click e you're gonna lose health look at this all right you're gonna lose health here and so make sure you guys be extra careful and once you guys made it out you guys can see you just rob the tomb let's go over here and add waypoint to the casino all right it's gonna be all the way up here here just like this and once you guys make it into the casino you have to find a code there's gonna be a hidden number over here you have to walk around to find it it could be on the wall it could be over here on this little you know chair right over here but yes guys 8268 is the number i'm gonna go over here and click 8268 just like that as soon as you guys enter the little uh, door you want to go here to security click on this little uh you know machine here until you guys find a red machine then you guys can go ahead and go back go down to the vault click e on the glasses and then you guys can go over here and make your way inside of this little vault right here you should see this door click e on the crack once you guys see the little green button all you need to do is click e again all right just do that three times and the door should be open for you i'm gonna go over here and grab this little cash so it looks like gta if you guys actually play gta you guys can see here it's kind of looks similar to gta but once you guys get the cash fill up your bag and then you can go ahead and escape again all right just like this you can already escape and you can go to the roof at waypoint you want to go back here to the volcano and just like this you just finishing robbing the casino in the game so you go over here and click on this little more info you should see which contract you can do so my contract was robbing the power plant robbing the casino and robbing the tomb so basically i just did all of that there's also going to be a police contract but last let's go over here and go to the airport and rob the plane all right so you have to be a cop to go ahead and call this plane get away into the plane go over here then we can rob the plane let's go ahead and get inside of the plane here all right we're gonna rob the plane today all right so the plane should be open you guys can go ahead and walk inside of the plane just like this there should be a lot of crates here then you can go over here and click e to inspect the crates just like this you just rob a crate all right now you want to go over here and go over on this side open the door and spawn a car and you want to go to the crown port just like this here all right you can go over here and rob this thing by go ahead and deliver the crate right here so the last robbery of the day is gonna be the cargo ships obviously this cargo ships here has the most cash what do you want to do guys is you want to get a helicopter then you want to go over here and click g on the helicopter all right just go over here and click g and then you can go over here and pick up the crate all right let's do this right over here just pick up the crates and apparently this thing is gonna shoot you so make sure you don't die because if you die it's gonna be over all right so i already kind of get the crate right here not really sure why it didn't register but there you go i just got the crate and then it should tell you where to go ahead and redeem this so the ship is a little bit hard to rob but it's literally give you guys the most money
money in the game. All right, so you want to go over here into this side. And then you want to go over here and click G to drop it just like this. Just got the cash. So that's basically all of the robberies. So basically, that is all of the robberies I just show you guys inside of the jailbreak. You are ready to master the game. However, if you guys know some glitches inside of Roblox jailbreak, it's going to make your, you know, escape super fast. Now you can go over here and crouch down. You guys want to zoom in first person as soon as you guys do that. Uncrouch and go over here. All right, so you guys can literally just escape the prison by doing this super, super fast. Escaping the prison in about literally like two seconds. And then you can spawn cars and escape and rob stuff. So yeah, knowing a little glitches here, it's going to be very helpful here. Next up is going to be shooting tips. Or basically, you guys need at least two guns. One is going to be far distance. One is going to be short distance. So if you guys, you know, standing over here and see that guy at far distance, you guys can go over here and, you know, shoot him. Or if you go over here and walk toward the opponent, you guys can go ahead and pull out your shotgun. Shotgun does a lot of damage and you just can literally just kill the guy in literally like, you know, three shots. Give me a like if this video helped you guys out robbing all of the store in Jailbreak and, and obviously be the Jailbreak Pro in the game. Alright, you guys can see here, we just literally destroyed this guy here. Keep using Stockholm VG where you guys buying Robux or Premium. It does help me out a tons. And subscribe for more because this was epic.